afternoon, we're here at the reopening of the Meadow Lake Carousel um, and the ribbon cutting ceremony. And I'm here with former commissioner Darren Rudy and the city manager of Enid, Eric Benson. So, Eric, you want to introduce I former would, commissioner? I'd like, few, I'd like right. to make a few remarks about the history of this uh, carousel. Okay. Not too many months ago, it was on the verge of laying dormant and it would had, had fallen ill repair. But there was a dedicated group of city citizens who decided to make this uh, a turnaround. And, you know, as is typically the case, the folks who get to cut the ribbon aren't always the ones whose idea or hard work made it happen. But today we get to talk and identify and extol the virtues of my good friend, Mr. Rudy, here. We had, I had the privilege of serving under his tenure as a city commissioner. And I know that this Ferris wheel and the, the, not Ferris wheel, the, the carousel and the refurbishment of these, uh, this tremendous asset wouldn't have been ha a possible without his efforts. And I, this community owes him a great debt, and we're very proud of what he's done. And today we get to see ample proof of his dedication. Darren, congratulations, and thank you for what thank you've you. done to make this happen. Uh, the biggest part of this has, of course, been from the city of Enid, the building and, and the finishing of the carousel. But I, I think that we don't want to leave out that a lot of the community came through and, and funded the refurbishment of the horses and so they sponsored horses including Eric and Barb Benson and um, those people need to be mentioned too because this has been a, a 10 year long project and it started with refurbishing the horses and by the time we got the horses about done the carousel was about to fall apart and that was a huge expense and the city stepped up and and they've created a jewel for the city of Enid and for the kids and, and all the families here because Having been in Kiwanis and driven the train and, and run the carousel, you see people bring their great-grandchildren who rode on it when they were kids. And so it's been here a long time. It's been a part of Enid a long time, and it's great to see it in this kind of a structure. And, and to this beautiful, beautiful building is just, it's great. So I have a question for both of you. Uh, so Enid has been building a lot of parks around, and you can see there's a new one over there. It's like a rocket ship, and we have an electrical one. So, but we still spent the time and the resources to, re, you know, refurbish this beautiful old relic of the city of Enid. Can you tell me the, like, what that tells about Enid's character? I think it, it shines very brightly, not on the, the commitment of the citizens of Enid, but more uh, precisely the city of Enid employees. This was uh, almost a start to finish rebuild by the employees after the horses were complete and the, the refurbishment of the mechanical pieces of the carousel were brought to us. They needed a tremendous amount of refining. All of the paint, all of the restoration you see here was done with city labor and they were thrilled to death to do it. It's an immense matter of pride to them and, and it reflects the kind of employee that we have in Enid. Tremendous folks. Definitely. Definitely. The thing about Enid is it's had beautiful parks throughout its history. And when things were tight and the budget wasn't there, the employees still maintained these parks in just a beautiful fashion, and they were always an attraction to the people in the area. And now uh, that times are a little better, uh, they can do even more, and it's, it's just wonderful. Yes, I completely agree. It's really beautiful. Now, one last question. Which horse is your favorite horse here at the carousel? Well, there's one named Nick that's my favorite. Oh, one named Nick? Can you yeah. tell me about it? Well, it was one that uh, Darren's idea, and uh, they refurbished one and uh, dedicated it to one of our sons. We're very, okay. very flattered by that. Now, that gave us then the opportunity to, to uh, support the refurbishment of another horse, which we call CO, or C-O-E. That's okay. dedicated to our city employees. Awesome. What about you? I have to go with Nick as well. I mean, Nick was <laughs> special. Awesome. Thank you both so much for taking the time to meet with us today and enjoy the barbecue and, you know, enjoy the carousel. Hope you get a chance to ride it. So. Thank you. You bet.